Right. Welcome to another session of wireless communication networks, Unit Five, wireless networking. Now we do, we discuss today's is universal mobile telecommunication system, universal mobile telecommunication system UMTS. Here, what is meant by UMTS? That is, which is used to provide variety of mobile services to a, a wide range of global mobile communication standards. Here, here, what is meant by variety of mobile services? Is that but in first generation we are using only for voice transmission. In second generation we are using for voice plus SMS, and 2.5 generation we are using voice plus SMS plus GPRS. And third generation for likewise, based upon the different services, can increase this by using this UMTS, Universal Mobile Telecommunication System. Here, nothing but uh, UMTS developed by RACE. Uh, actually, what is meant RACE here? R&D. R&D in Advanced Communications Technologies in Europe. R&D in Advanced Communications Technologies in Europe. Especially, this UMTS is implemented from third generation onwards. Here, how the Universal Mobile Telecommunication System implements. Actually, this is also implemented on MAN network. Here, you know the concept of cell. Here, what is the cell? We are taking total geography area and divide into small parts. Each small part is called a cell. Each part is a smell. Support to increase the number of channels. We are doing cell splitting and cell sectoring concepts. Here also, we are using in this EMTS to dividing the number of cells by the macrocells, microcells, picocells to utilize the more spectrum efficiency. To more spectrum efficiency. Yes, say this one. And uh, this is the original cell. This is the macro cell. That is original cell. That is what we are taking geographic area and divide into small parts into the macro cell. Again, this macro cell divide into concept of micro cell. You know what is the exact structure of cell is called the hexagonal shaped cell. Again, this micro cell divide into pico cells by the cell splitting concept. By the cell splitting concept. Why you are going for cell splitting concept to increase the number of channels for more number of subscribers? Instead of single base station, we are using multiple base stations. Then increase the number of channels. Here, this is the network architecture of EMTS. That is, first geography area divided into ma macro cells. Again, macro cells divided into micro cells. And again, each micro cell divided into pico cells, which increase the spectrum efficiency and number of channels. Here, what is the use of this EMTS? First one. Here, the use of uh, EMTS is. Network reachability. That is, the network maintains a constant location information on each of the terminals. Constant location information on each of the terminals. That is, whenever the mobile user moves from one base station to another base station, it can be update the location area uh, by using broadcasting some control messages. And other advantage of this UMTS is it maintains a distributed network databases. Distributed network database for routing of calls uh, once the exact location of the mobile has been accessed. Uh, this is about universal mobile uh, telecommunication system, which is used in third generation. And this is developed by RACE, and which is used to provide more number of services throughout the global communications. Uh, do you have any query? Type your query in the chat box. Thank you, thank you very much.